Hi, today's lesson, we're going to build upon a lesson we did really early on in this kind of series. We created a simple slideshow in um, Adobe Flash with three slides. Um, we added one bit of music. But what we're going to do this time is we're going to have a, a kind of sound or a, a music playing for each slide. So that's what we're going to do today. Let me just give you a demo of where we're headed. So let me just run the one that you currently see. This is one I did earlier. Let me just run it so that you know what to expect by the end of this lesson. So I'm just running it. And as you can see, what you can see, I don't know if you can hear that. Let me make it louder. As each slide transitions, a different bit of music is playing. And that is what we're going to try and achieve right now. Let me close that down. So you got you've got a preview of where we're headed. So let's get started. Okay, so I'm gonna um, remove the layers I put in here. So I'm gonna delete those. Delete and delete and delete. Now, this is just the slideshow on its own, and just to prove that to you, I'll just run it very quickly. Test the movie, just... Hi, today what we want to do is we want to create a... Um, add three different tracks of music to a, to a flash slideshow. Basically, if you look at this, um, what we have here, this is just an idea of where we're headed. Just have a quick look and a quick listen. So as the slideshow changes, and the music changes, and that's what we're trying to achieve. Okay? So that was one I made earlier. Now let's go to our own slideshow here. So the first thing we need to do is we need to import the music into the library. Two ways to import music in Flash. The first one is go to File, Import, Import to Library, select the tracks you, that you want to use, and import them. So mine should be either in downloads. So I want um, this one open. And there you see it here. I want another one, file, import, import to library. Uh, let's go back to downloads. Uh, do I have any airport lounge? Yep, that one, import. That's one way to import. Now, another way to import, if I could just drag this across, is to simply drag them drag the music into the library. As you all know, drag in the music. So open up your folder wherever the music is, uh, documents or downloads, wherever that music might be. Uh, let's shift this down. So I'm looking for some music, disco music, is that in there? No, nope, that's not it. I'm looking for music. So let's have a look. Do I have any music in here? Okay, guitar. Right, so exactly all you need to do is just drop it in. So I've got guitar, I've got airport music and airport arcade. Maybe I'll just put one more just in case. Uh, okay, what's wrong with this? Oh, okay, replace, sorry, I was not looking. Okay, I've replaced that. So let's go forward. Right, so I'm gonna, there's one more mysterious. And let's pull that in. So you can pull it in like that. And pull music into your library like that. Okay, so that's done. So I, I've imported the tracks that I want. Next stage is now to add the tracks. So the first thing you do is click the layer that you want it to play with and add a layer. So the layer will be directly put on top of that layer. So I want this first bit of music to play from here all the way till this image disappears, which is Till about here really it starts to fade out so there at this point um, I click and I drag the music on so the one that I'm thinking of is airport lounge music so you can see that you can even play it here that's right that's what it sounds like just in case you didn't know and you can stop it like that if I'll select the music the one I want and I'll drag it sorry I'll simply drag it onto the stage. Stop the music, sorry. Play, stop. Right. Right. 
right so this is the piece of music i want to drag on so once i've selected you select the first frame in the new layer make sure all others are locked it just makes it easier and simply drag that particular track onto the um, canvas or the scene and there you go you see in that layer you've got a layer of music but what happens is that music will play till the end so if I go in and just have a test of the movie you will see it's playing on every slide on every slide same music now there's nothing wrong with that but that's not what we wanted so how do we get the music to play just for the period of that slide the way to do that is to click where you want the music to end which is here and insert a blank keyframe now you notice suddenly the music actually gets to this point and then it's only running for that period let's see if that's actually true again go to control test your movie I just like to test it just to prove to you okay so it's still playing so we haven't quite succeeded so what will make it stop so what we need to do at this point is at that same point right click um, what, click at that point and go into properties now in properties you can see on that frame there's no music so what you want to do is select the music that's playing which is the air, airport from music lounge and then what you want to tell it to do at this point is you want it to stop so specifically you're telling it to stop at that point so let's try that did that work let's go in and test the movie again let's see now as the slide changes, the music no longer plays. But when the slide comes back, look, there goes the music. It's back again. So we've succeeded. So if we want to add three tracks, that's the, for the first layer. So from here to here, that's what's going to be playing. So for the second slide, again, you need to add a new layer. You can either right click and insert the layer, or you can come down to here and insert the layer. Now, we want it to start playing from where this one stops playing. So click on that frame, and then what you do is you insert a keyframe. Now, what music do we want to play? Go to your library. Let's put in on this one, uh, I don't know, arcade chippy tunes. So drag it across, it's there. And again, it's doing exactly the same thing. It's running all the way to the end of the scene, which is not what we want. We actually want it to disappear as that picture begins to disappear which is about here so click where you want it to end right click insert a blank keyframe key and then go to properties and in properties select the music that's playing and say what you want it to do which is to stop at this point so we now have two pieces of music playing let's have a test and see if it's working in that way da -da, da -da. control test movie in flash it's playing, that's the first thing. So it's working, right. So the third slide, click on the slide, go down and insert a new layer. You've got your new layer there where the music, second piece of music stops. You want to insert a keyframe. You want to get go to the library, select the song that you're looking for, which in this case is the mysterious one, pull it onto the scene and it plays to the end, but we still have to stop it so that it doesn't continue to play whilst the first one comes in. So again, you have to insert a blank keyframe, go into their properties, select the music, which is mysterious, and then you want it to stop. So all you want it to do at that point is stop. So you could, um, let's test it and see if it works. Control, test movie in flash, and one, Happy song and a mysterious song. So it works. And that is how you insert three pieces, three different um, soundtracks or music tracks into your slideshow to play in accordance with the slide changes. Um, thank you for listening, and I hope you have success in trying to do this. And I'll meet you hopefully in another session. Bye.